Hi, I'm Amelia. I'm the dog trainer here at Advanced Animal Care of Colorado. Today we're going to talk about how to keep your dog from defecating in their crate. There are a couple things to keep this from happening. One being the size of your crate. That is very important. Cabernet, go to bed. You want to make sure you have a crate that's big enough for your dog to stand up and turn around, but you also don't want your crate to be too big. Now dogs generally won't go to the bathroom in their bed, so if the crate is small enough, they're not going to go to the bathroom where they're sleeping. However, if your crate is too big, they may find an area to go to the bathroom and then find an area to sleep. So you want to keep in mind that, say if you purchase a puppy and you are going to buy a crate, eventually your puppy's going to be maybe a lab, large dog, um, you can find a partition and partition your crate for the time being so they're in a smaller area. Or if you have a small dog, then just purchase a crate that is smaller for them. And you want to make it nice and cozy, have blankets in there, have some maybe some toys to put in there, give them things to do. But you want to make sure that they can definitely stand up like Cabernet is doing here and then turn around. Can you spin? Cabernet, spin. Okay, maybe not. But at least so they can move around in their crate. Another thing is very important about your dog defecating or going to the bathroom um, in your crate, in their crate, is to make sure you get them on a very good potty schedule. You never want to leave your dog crated for more than eight hours, so overnight is fine, but you want to make sure you get them to go to the bathroom right before you put them in, and certainly right after you take them out. Also make sure that if you have a young puppy, that if you feed them and then put them in their crate, you take them out about 20 minutes later so they can go to the bathroom. Um, you don't want them to have to go and then be forced to go in their bed. Certainly that's a habit they can start to pick up if they're forced to do it over and over again. And it's also not healthy for the dog. Um, so make sure you have a good sized crate, not too big, not too small. Make sure to get your dog on a proper potty schedule. And I hope this helps. Thanks for watching. Again, I'm Amelia, um, the dog trainer here at Advanced Animal Care of Colorado. Thank you.